Detroit Interim Police Chief James White sending a message to people looking to break the law. Thank you so much for staying with us. I'm Alan Campbell. Now that warning comes after the city responded to several issues with people drag racing on roads or turning violent in Greektown. 7 Actions reporter Kim Russell with a look at the chief's plan to keep people safe. Detroit police say that one reason they've had problems with crowds in areas like Greektown and street racing in Detroit lately is that there is this perception that Detroit is lawless. They shared video as evidence. We're going to Detroit. We are not going to get in trouble. We could, but we won't. Police say this video is evidence posted on YouTube of two men in Kalamazoo talking about going street racing in Detroit. There should be like roughly a thousand dollars. I don't think bail would be higher than that for street racing. Police say play stupid games, win stupid prizes. These men have won forfeiture proceedings. Police say they tracked down the two Lamborghinis and the Dodge Charger Hellcat seen racing in the video posted, seized them and plan to keep them. There is a perception that you can come into the city uh, and these laws won't be enforced. To stop this, police unveiled a five-point plan. They are increasing police patrols with overtime targeting, drag racing, and areas where there have been issues with crowds, such as the Riverwalk and Greektown. This was the scene in Greektown early Sunday morning during the first weekend since the pandemic began that bars could stay open until 2 a.m. in Detroit. We get it. We've all been shuttered in place. We're coming out of COVID. We're reemerging. We understand but we have to do so responsibly. Police say they will also be enforcing parking lot and noise ordinances. Businesses playing music out on the street after 10 o'clock at night is attracting groups who couldn't legally go inside and drink. And police are teaming up with community members. For example, there will be peace walks this weekend. The idea is that having people against crime out walking will deter criminals. We're not gonna quit by any means necessary. We wanna mobilize the citizens of Detroit. If you want to volunteer and get involved in this community work to prevent crime, we'll have information at our website, WXYZ.com. In Detroit, Kim Russell, 7 Action News. Kim, thank you.